All right, guys. So uh, Richard, uh, a Alpha Delta Seven Charlie, made this DDS VFO, which is really pretty and works wonderfully. So I decided I would replicate it and build one for my Beach Forty, and it's coming together quite nicely. Ignore the chip in the back because it's just sitting there hanging out from the last time I was building an amplifier. So we currently have it set at 29999 and it doesn't work. I don't know if it's my radio's fault or what. However, if we swing on over, we bring it down just a bit. So now we're at 29630. Let's kick it over on this guy. Sorry about the lack of backlighting. Oops, it would help if I turn the knob the right way. T962. Or 64. So, let's take it down. 63. So there it's 63 and 300 odd hertz. Close enough for my standards. My standards are pretty low. So, we get this, and still nothing. So, 29, oh, I'm at 9.6. Hold on. I'm being silly. I did this earlier and had the same issue. So we will drop it down to 6.40, 6.30, right there. So now, yeah, if I get my camera's shadow out of the way, we got 29, 630, and something odd hertz. And, as you can hear, there's a tone in the radio. So, let's drop it down the rest of those hertz. Four, three, two, one. And now we're at 49.630 exactly. So I'll just tap it over. And you can hear it. So we're getting signal out of it. And then we'll lower it on down quite a bit. Let's bring it down to around 5, 511. So now we're megahertz down and we will go into our megahertz drop mode and go to five. Five fifteen. And we'll drop. Five, five, eleven. Yeah, my my more skills are terrible, so ignore me. But uh, as you can see, we're getting signal there. So it seems to be working. So uh, there you go. That's uh, your circuit. Same exact uh, Arduino, and I'm assuming same board with the two layers of pens and one layer out. This is Kilo Foxtrot 7 Zulu Mike Lima, and I'll come back to you when I have it installed in the radio, which will probably be a couple days.